there is one thing that every kitchen in the world needs, and that's pots and pans. So let me show you a set from Royal Catering. It has 16 pieces, so let me just go over uh, each piece uh, very quickly. So you have a 6 litre pot for your soups and sauces, you have 2.8 litre pan, a 3 litre pot, a, uh, well, it's a steaming attachment, then you have also a 2 litre uh, bowl with a fitting lid and a, a grip for it. And then you have two, uh, well, as I said, and a pot with 1.3 litre uh, capacity. Also in the set, you're getting two um, protective pads for your uh, work surface. All right. So these come in really handy. So now we've talked through all the elements. Let's just go over each individually uh, into detail. So uh, the six litre pot, each pot, by the way, comes with a fitting lid. Uh, talking about the lid, uh, the lid has a special vent on it, so that will vent all the excess steam. Uh, also, it has a uh, plastic grip for it. As you can see, there's a uh, thermometer on it. So that may come in uh, really handy as well. It goes in like a 30 degrees uh, set, so it goes from 0 to 32, then from 32 to 64 in normal, and then from 64 to 98 uh, for high. So actually, without having a proper look, uh, every chef will know exactly what's happening inside just by the information given by the thermometer. Uh, talking about the pots, each pot has a really nice polish to it inside. Uh, there's a measure inside also that makes it possible to see how much of the ingredients you have inside. Uh, the handles have some plastic in it which makes them heat proof. Uh, also, one piece of advice, uh, these lids are great for ceramic stoves, uh, induction stoves, um, electric. You can do some cooking on a gas stove, but because of those lids you have to be really careful with it, so I wouldn't recommend it necessarily. Uh, the greatest feature about the pot, each and every pot by the way, is the uh, bottom, the lid, uh, sorry, the, the bottom of it. So first of all, it's quite thick and it has uh, seven sandwich layer uh, in it. So there's different materials involved and what this does, uh, basically it's just for um, temperature uh, conduction. So uh, basically what, uh, what happens is uh, each layer has uh, different, um, well, capabilities. So they will sort of like a slower or faster conducted temperature, which actually prevents burning. Uh, not 100%, but definitely gives you, you a, uh, a margin for your mistake. So it's sort of sl slowly, slower uh, conducted temperature. All right, moving on, the pan. The pan has 2.8 litre capacity. Uh, it has a uh, carved surface so, um, with a higher edge to it, so you can uh, fry and uh, afterwards you can do sauces in it. Of course, it has two handles also, plastic in it, so they're heat proof. Uh, and it's quite heavy as well, which is good for a frying pan because it means it will keep the temperature quite well. All right, the three litre pot. Well, for sauces, uh, spuds and stuff like that, but its main feature is it will fit the uh, steaming attachment. So what you do is you just put some water inside, you put the steaming attachment on top, uh, your ingredients in it, drop the lid, and the steam will cook your ingredients. So that's pretty cool. All right, the bowl, as I said, comes with a fitting lid, and in order to make it easier to grab the lid and lift it up, you have this knob with a suction cap. So what you do is just press it down and it's easier to hold on to it. All right, these two little babies, well, that's for your garnishes and stuff like that. So they come in really handy uh, in the kitchen, especially uh, when you're doing dishes with multiple ingredients. So you don't need, uh, let's say, a ton of puree. You can do it in this little pot. Or you can boil two eggs in it, whatever. Uh, but these pads, uh, I find it really useful to have uh, these two in the set uh, because as it happens, uh, when you're cooking a lot, uh, you need to put these pots somewhere. So if you put it on your really expensive workbench at home, you may damage the surface. So having these two uh, is really cool uh, because you can put your pot on top of it and you protect your workbench surface. 
Right, I found one uh, question on the internet that is repeatedly asked in regards to these pots. Um, as it happens, uh, while cooking, um, you need to put your pot into the uh, oven for different reasons, like, you know, especially when you're uh, trying to keep something at the right temperature or when you're reheating something uh, and you have all your burners taken. Um, well, it ha does happen. I w wouldn't recommend uh, doing it with these pots because of the plastic grips and handles. So uh, they may melt. Besides, like, you know, when you put them uh, in the stove, uh, in an oven, uh, they might eventually get hot or melt. So you would damage the pots. All right. I hope I covered the topic completely. I thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you liked it and I see you next time.